Welcome to the button, speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap their date for another person. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, then they will have all expenses paid for a second date. This is the button. Hey, my name is Kyle. What's happening here? What do you mean? I don't understand. I filled out papers and I was promised that I meet girls here. Maybe you should, you know, be more progressive. Maybe you need to realize that life isn't a Bioware game, where it's up to you to decide someone's preferences. I know, it's a shame. You don't remember me? Should I? Dude, you were on a speed date with me like two weeks ago. Oh yeah, I remember something like that. Are you stalking me? I don't even remember you. I remember every person I've talked to. I wish I had such a good memory. No, it's easy to remember when you talk only with a few people. Oh, maybe you Kyle want to tell Nathan about your preferences in bed. No, thank you. Well then. You really don't have to. I don't know if it's because I can't keep up with the times or something. But I like it when my partner doesn't shave down there. We all appreciate this information. Now you. I don't think I will. Oh, I can't believe you did that. Nathan, how do you feel rejecting someone? You know what? It's my first time. It's just a shame that was a guy. Now that's just silly. Is something wrong? My name is... Cindy. Oh, how did you know? I have the gift of clairvoyance. Can you predict something for me? Sure, what do you want? Will I find someone who shares my preferences in the near future? You know, I know someone who might interest you. Really? Yes. Is he handsome? Similar to you. What do you mean? Don't do this to me. I want to be nice in front of the camera. Nathan. Please tell me why you didn't fill in the section. Something embarrassing about myself that I wouldn't want to discuss on air. That's a rhetorical question. He is a 29-year-old virgin. Oh, lol. Is it for religious reasons? Yeah. Sad. You know, I don't judge. My previous partner slept with over 100 people and he also said it was for religious reasons. I think he lied, there is no faith like that. He was the leader or something. That's not a bad idea. Oh. How do you feel about rejecting a woman this time? I have to say, I feel good, this, how to even explain, a surge of superiority. Now I know why women swipe left on me. I won't lie, you can get addicted to it. Hey, I'm Moxie. Nathan, is that your real name? Yes. Oh, okay. I'm pan. You what? I'm pansexual. Don't you know what it means? Not really. It means that, at least for me, the concept of gender doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what your background is. What matters to me is that we can truly connect, I prefer that our relationship doesn't start at a certain stage if you know what I mean. What matters more to me is to bound on a spiritual level. So in other words, you're just a bi person who doesn't participate in hookup culture? Like a sane person should. Did I say something wrong? Can you guess? I don't think that's legal. What's illegal is taking up space for two rounds. They wanted to eliminate me too. How did you know? Just a hunch. Why the hair color? Nice try buddy, I won't stop pressing this button. Just asking. I started dyeing my hair in high school and it stuck with me, do you have a problem with that? Yes. Honest to the bone I see. Don't all women sometimes say that it's bad that men don't want to be honest with their true emotions? That depends on the guy. Depend if he is a hunk. Oh, Nathan, I'm sorry, but you've been eliminated. Not the first and not the last time. And how did it go? Your turn now. Is she pretty? Very colorful personality. Dyed hair? Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I like those. One date and boom, I'm in. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm positive. She's pan. Like a frying pan? You'll find out. Dude, don't be like that. Should I be afraid or something? Tell me, I promise I'll avenge you. 
You need to promise me that you bring a hellfire on that frying pan. Pinky promise. If she's pretty, he will not do it. Dude, don't listen to him. He's just jealous that you're my favorite friend. Really? Yeah. Hi, I'm Julian. Moxie. Nice to meet you. I have to say, I didn't expect someone like you. In a good way? Yes, I'm pleasantly surprised. Julian works at a nightclub for mobsters. What do you think about that? What the actual fu- That must be very exciting, like in the movies. Not really, but club tickets are free. Would you take me with you? Sure. What music do you listen to? Indie rock and roll, alternative. It allows me to connect with my soul on a spiritual level. Oh really? What are you looking for in a relationship? Physical matters take a back seat for me. I'm looking for someone with whom I can establish a true connection, someone who will understand me, and make it easier for me to connect on a spiritual level. Oh, just like me. Really? Yes, I'm Pan by the way. You too? What a small world. Ever since I finished college, I haven't been able to meet anyone who shares my opinion on those matters. You finished college? How old are you? 26. That wasn't necessary. Nathan, may your soul finally rest in peace. I think you should go. Your turn now. If you were faster, you would have at least made it to the second round. You should have stretched prior. Power is taking L's again. No, they kicked me out because I broke the table and the button. You failed me. Nathan Bart, forgive me. Well, I guess it's the end, let's go home. What, we are not going home. No one is going. They still don't have enough material to insert a mid-roll lad. They said they'll figure something out soon. I'm hungry. Aren't we all? Hi, my name is Pan. I mean Moxie. Sebastian. So, tell me something about yourself. Is something wrong? I'm sorry, I'm trying to remember my answers to that question. So, what are your hobbies and what do you do in your free time? Well, I don't really have hobbies unless you count hangovers. I drink a lot, play PlayStation, waste money. Sad. Well, it's a bit sad. And you? I go out with friends to pubs to dance once every two weeks. I like listening to music and building my presence on social media. Also sad. If you want, press it I don't mind. Oh okay. <laughs>